Hello guys, welcome back to another video. Today we are going to be doing 10 things that every single pl Fortnite player hates. Now, I don't know if this is just my list, but I thought, well, most people hate these things, but I don't know. And uh, so, number 10, bad storm look. So, what this would mean is... You know, you just got, you just put your base up, you're in the top like four or something, and you have your nice base, and it's pretty fortified, and all of a sudden out of nowhere, the Stormite does not cooperate, well, mainly, it's like, you think, oh, it's so gonna do it, it's gonna, I'm around the mountain, obviously Stormite's gonna do it, and then the Stormite moves like, one little inch away from your base, and you're sitting there going, why? Um, no, it's just, it's bad luck, honestly, but. Anyway, number nine. Getting outplayed. Now, this is probably not the most frustrating thing, that's why it's number nine. But it feels frustrating at the same time and I hate it. I'm pretty sure most players hate it too. You know, you're you're building and all of a sudden this guy just builds really fast, usually about Omega skins or John Wicks, and it's like, oh my god, they're fast. Um and it's really annoying, like you think you're about to kill them and they just outplay you and you have full health and they just shotgun you once in the face. Um, number eight, okay. So this is probably, eh, it's related to number ten, but this is when the storm kills you because it's so rare. When the storm in Fortnite actually kills you. It usually does this and the reason why is people hate it including me, is that it doesn't happen often, so you feel, like, angry, especially if you come in second place because of it, and, yeah, it's just, it's really frustrating to even get in the storm for too long, and it's just, yeah, no, don't do it. Alright, number seven, getting pickaxe to death. I don't know about you, but sometimes I'd land on roofs, like, I would, I would have a gun, literally I'd have a shotgun. And this guy would go and start pickaxing me, and I die. And I had a shotgun because he would just go crazy, and I'd be sitting there going, "Wow!" Or other times I'd actually have a gun, and he wouldn't, and they pickaxe me to death. And now there's other times where like there's no guns on the roof, and then there's like three people, and we all pickaxe each other to death, and it's so frustrating to die from it because you think. Wow, they didn't even use a gun. How is that even fair? They're doing 10 damage. Anyway, I before I get angry about it. Anyway, number six. Not getting revived. Now, I'm pretty sure so many people hate this unless you don't play duos or squads. It's when you know your teammates right next to you and you're yelling on your microphone, get get me revived now and they go out and just try to kill the squad and die. And you, you all of the people who are just waiting to be revived and your all your teammates die, you know. You're the, like okay, so, you know, this happened to me often where I get knocked out, my friend comes over and tries to kill him, but the team kills me first. Or the other situation usually is I'm with him, like literally on the side of the ramp, with my friend. And then I get knocked out. But he decides to go and push towards a squad of four. And then gets killed, and I'm sitting there going, why did you do that? Now, it's, I'm not saying you shouldn't not revive people. You should revive people all the time, I should say. But I'm saying that you really gotta think about what you're doing first before you make a huge play. Uh, the, but there's times you should not. Like, you know, your teammate's like out in the open, and there's a squad that's like literally firing at him. Yeah, you probably shouldn't do it. Anyway, number five, getting one pumped in the face. Now, I feel like it would be a number one or two if this was like a few months ago. But because of the nerf of the shotgun, honestly, I feel like the pump isn't that annoying. Um, it's still annoying because you sometimes you'll have the pump and you'll do like 37 damage or something, and then this guy hits you in the face once and you die. And you just go, why? Because, honestly, they made the shotgun do less damage, but that doesn't mean that you should complain about the nerf. It's usually because, you know, it shoots out a spray of pellets, um, and usually you miss the pellets. So, 
Pro players are usually the ones who usually get this, but I don't know. It just happens once in a while. I, I hate it. It really is annoying. Just get one hit in the face. Alright, number four. This is not the most frustrating thing for me, at least. I don't know about other players, but, you know, come in second place. Okay. Honestly, it's not that frustrating. It's just that I feel like it still deserves to be in the top five, honestly. Like, it just is that frustrating. Um, honestly, it just... You really can't control it if the player's better than you or not. And it just, it's just annoying, especially if you're in squads and, you know, you, you're, like, by yourself and there's a team of four and you come to second place. Like, you, you know you, there's no hope. It's really annoying, okay? Um, I feel like it's not annoying because you can get over the fact that you could win other games. So, yeah, and you can also learn from it. So, I kind of see that it's not the biggest deal. Anyway. Number three. Now, this is really frustrating. Top three. This means these are the three most annoying things ever. Everyone hates. And this is number three, which is bad luck. Alright, so, you know, you go to the, I don't know, Tilt Towers, and you find a white AR and an SMG, and that's it. You keep finding the same guns, like, literally over and over. And you go to kill someone, and they drop, like, a gray pistol with a gray AR and you're sitting there going what the heck and this I mean I'm over exaggerating but usually you'll get like green and gray and maybe sometimes blue stuff but it's like end game you have a green AR for your best AR and you're killing people and they're dropping like you know blue ARs but you can't get it because you're in the top 10 there's people who will just kill you because there's bases all over the place and it's like oh it just is and it's annoying also bad luck also goes with the players you know you know, you're just relaxing, you're moving along, and you find no one. It's so boring. Honestly, that's so absolutely boring to just run for, like, a minute or a few minutes. Like, I know it's not a big deal, but honestly, it's annoying. And that's part of bad luck. Bad luck is just, I'm not finding any players with good loot, I don't have any good loot, and I can't find any chests. Like, that's basically what bad luck is. And it's happened to me so many games. And it's probably happened to so many other players, too. And it's just no one's favorite thing. Alright, number two. When you have no materials. Okay, so you have no materials in a build battle. So, you know, like, this guy, you're building battle, and you run out of materials. That's when it's the most frustrating. But... The other time it's most frustrating when you actually need to build and you have nothing. And you die. Because of it, it's like, it's nothing, and then you really are like feeling forced to just knock down a tree, but honestly, it's so frustrating because of the fact usually you get in a fight when you have no materials and you forget about it. it you have to pay attention to it, but honestly, it's hard to pay attention in a build battle when you lose the materials all of a sudden. And you can tell when someone does. So then the the, the person's going against you is probably just going to one-pump you in the face or something. Which is very unlikely, but it can happen. If you, unless you play aggressively or smart strategically anyway. Number one. Dying because you didn't get the gun first. Okay, this is probably the most um, hated thing ever. Because you land, you see this gun. And this pump. You land right next to it, and this guy comes in and just swoops in and takes it away right before you got it, and he chases you down even though you have nothing. And I understand, I really do understand that, you know, you want that one kill, because kills are cool. And you're, you're just chasing down, and this guy has nothing. Like, why? It's so annoying, it happens to me every other game. And I feel like it happens to everyone else, because I've done it to people too. You know, you see this SMG. You land first, you pick it up, and you you chasing down this guy until you kill him. And this guy has no loot when he dies, and you just decide to do it anyway. Or someone else does it to you. It's so frustrating, though, as the player who has the situation, because you had nothing. Why would they waste their time trying to kill a person who has nothing, and they know it? It's just so frustrating, honestly. It, it's probably the most frustrating thing ever. Um... There's nothing that can top it out. It's just like, yeah. 
Anyway, hopefully you guys enjoyed. Um, yeah, and I will. I want to say my goal for this video is five likes. So, if you can reach five likes, that would be nice. Um, and goodbye.